Welcome everyone. Today is part two of Will It Print. Yesterday we showed you some examples we printed, we 3D printed, but they didn't work for the Nokia Lumia 820. Today we have some other examples in other materials. So, as you can see here on my desk, this is the first example we want to show you. It's uh, 3D printed in transparent resin. So I'm gonna click it on our cell phone, like this. It goes really smoothly, okay. And it looks very good actually. It's, it looks really sophisticated. Um, it's really nice. It's a really nice design actually, really nice material. But of course the question is, will the buttons work? So we have to try to put it on by pushing the button, but no. So this one, very nice. We'd get an award for the nicest design, but unfortunately buttons don't work. So it's not functional. So our next print we have is prime gray. Um, it's a little bit more, um, well, as you can see, you can bend it. I will try to put it on our phone again. Okay, clicks on really good. Okay, it looks good. Um, but again, we'll try the buttons. And no, it doesn't function at all, fortunately. So um, the third material we want to show you is the Alamite. It looks really good. It's really nice printed, but I think if we click it on, I can see it already, that the buttons won't function at all. It's, yeah, okay, so this is working, but again, it's getting a little bit boring now, but buttons, they don't function. So finally, our last material we want to test. So as you can see here, it's actually printed in two materials because with a Stratasys printer, it's possible to choose for a, a hard material, material. This is um, a kind of resin and the buttons, you can see it's black and it's not rubber, but it looks and it feels a little bit like rubber. So let's try it on. Okay, that works. And now I can push the button, so that's a good thing. But the thing is, well, my fingers are getting a little bit tired of pushing the buttons all the time, but this goes a little bit smoother and you see, it, uh, it works. But if you want to have, well, better noise uh, or better music, louder music, the buttons don't function really good. So it's, if I would have to give an award to the best functioning design without any engineering, this would be the one. But is it enough to sell it to other people? I don't think so. So watch us how we make the real thing. So in the Trimatic software of Materialize, I did some design iterations. I taken the cover, I uh, added some extra functionality on the bottoms and I changed the edge of the cover. Afterwards, I did all these iterations. I switched to the Magic software and there I prepared the files to be printed. Okay, we're here live at the printers at Materialize. We're gonna see if our engineers are as good as they told us they are. So we're gonna put on the Polomite 3D print on the Nokia Lumia 820. It clicks on really good. It fits. But now the big question, will the buttons work? So I'm gonna take a closer look and you can see it as well. I'm gonna try the button here. I think this one works and then 
Will we see our volume? So you have to look at the, at the front here, push it on again. Here you can see the volume. I think it's working really good. So the buttons, they look really smooth. It's very, very um, good and nice and easy to push the button. So I think we have a first 3D printed functional design made by Materialize.